The shame tells me not to tell you about the men who saw my softness or my blackness and called it an opening but did not call me girlfriend. I did not know love only has one name, that anyone who comes to you wanting a mother or a distraction or a ride or die is a thief. What is misogyny but a parasite in the mirror, a liar in a lover's mouth? A man's voice licks my ear even when I'm alone, teaches me the angles I look worst in. I was born a black girl and I've been lonely ever since. My friend, who's not black, says he doesn't know how to deal with rejection because he's never wanted someone who didn't want him back. A privilege to be more than a skeleton with blood everyone can see, to be allowed flesh and soul, to get to be whole. I want to tell you that once I loved a black girl, and it was miraculous when we were alone. In public, we avoided men, got asked a lot if we were sisters. Have you ever had to make a choice between truth and danger? Did you know for centuries, white men in brothels have paid to watch black women have sex with each other? Do you know how it feels to be gazed upon, to be looked at under the knife in a man's eye, to know strangers are raising their dicks and soiling your name while you try to make it home? There is no territory untouched by black women's blood. There is no lover I have had that I haven't also feared except her. The shame was wearing my hands when I threw my favorite CDs in the trash. Each girl-powered anthem chanted in pop songs reminded me how unsophisticated my interests are. The shame forbids dancing in public, hisses a reminder that men eat with their eyes and will feast whenever my body appears. The shame almost crawled up my throat and spoke to my ex-girlfriend before I choked and shoved it in the deep well of myself. I couldn't wield my tongue like an ax and say I loved her in the same breath. The first time I loved a black girl, I learned to love myself. I say girl because it's what we're not allowed to be, except around each other. I take back my shaved head, my hair uncurled and nappy, everything I prefer over someone else's image of me. I whisk my six-year-old self to a tender present, offer the grace I was denied a gentle hand at the back of the neck, a lesson in commitment. Yesterday, I loved a black girl, and today, that girl is myself. Whenever I go missing, let me return here first. Let me choose myself first. <laughs>